Hello everybody and welcome back to the Mega Modded Dead God Plus series. We're jumping in for another new run. Our streak is not doing so hot. Unfortunately, the last episode had a lot of crashes, but we got Eden again, who we've actually completed a decent amount for. We've done a Delirium run and we've done some of the Dark Room run. Um, so let's 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 just lock in with Mother this time around. Let's just lock in with Mother and a rather interesting start. So for one, we got the the pork chop, which of course. Doesn't matter too much, it does give us a heart container, so we would have started with one less if we didn't get that. But, having the ability to get some pill mimicking going on, right off the bat, is really, really interesting. And, for the question of the day today, just because I don't have one off of the top of my head, instead of asking a question to you guys, I want all of your guys' question of the day suggestions. What would you like to see other people answer and also see me answer because I not, uh, quite often answer the question of the day here. I'm recording for the second time today so I've not got one right off the top of my head so I'd be interested to know what you guys have in the old brain boxes there because you guys have given me some really really interesting ones in the past um, so it'd be really cool to see. But let's hope we get a good item of item room here. We do get a key off the bat here. I was kind of hoping for a bomb just because we do have a lot of different ways to use bombs here. Oh, hello, hello. Ah, uh, there's a pill, there's a pill. And it's a pretty, okay, that's pretty heckin' good. We can only have a maximum of three of these, so that's not amazing. Finger's actually kind of good as well here. Uh, that's not amazing. We can only have a maximum of three, but all we need is another six room of charges and use the third one, and we've got three already, so pretty good going but yeah the, the finger i can never remember if the finger takes or takes on your damage but either way i remember it being pretty good and i can't remember if it ever got fixed because i know that it could apply status effects and then repentance broke that i'm not sure if that was ever fixed but either way it's a nice bit of extra damage to have and it kind of acts as like pseudo spectral and it adds, it adds a decent amount of extra DPS. A decent amount of extra DPS. But yeah, the last episode I was kind of talking about, it's the same day as I said, I was kind of talking about getting gearing up to go. I, I haven't actually been out yet. I was uh, expecting to do it um, earlier in the day, but my um, my new contract only just came into play. So I'm just waiting for my phone to charge now, and then I'm going to be heading out. But I've got something exciting coming up pretty soon for me, so... I'm backlogging a few extra videos because I am going to a wedding next week. Um, it is... Wait a minute. Okay, let's let's charge this up first and we'll come back to you. Um, yeah, I've got a wedding. I've only ever been to one other wedding in my life. Um, and both of them, this one and the one I went previously to, are both my girlfriend's cousins. Um, so, kind of interesting. But yeah, um, going to one apparently is quite a posh wedding. So, I'm, uh, I'm kind of looking forward to it. I think it's going to be kind of exciting. Um... Like I said, I haven't been to really any others apart from this one, so especially not one that's posh. So I'm really, 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 really interested in, to see how it goes, and I'm kind of excited for it, to be honest. I think it's going to be quite a fun, um, quite a fun experience. I'm quite ready. Oh, that is good. Ooh. Bad trip is annoying. Amnesia's annoying. Tears down is annoying. And two I found pills. Yay! <laughs> Ooh, wait, wait a minute, wait, 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 wait a minute. That was unfortunately not very good. The tears downs especially. Oh, that's a tears down as well. So I'm kind of glad we didn't use that. How am I going to do this? That is not how I'm going to do this. Damn it. <laughs> I mean, at least I didn't take that pill. Basically, the, all this is saying to me is I would have been taking a tears down pill regardless. I would have taken that one with placebo pill and tried it out. So either way I went about this, I would have been taking a tears down. So it was inevitable. Um, but yes, I actually went out shopping for like a... I didn't get a suit, but I got like some nice trousers and a belt and some new shoes and stuff. Getting all smart. And I, I, I obviously I don't really dress smart in normal life. I mean, I'm not a very fashionable person anyways. I really just couldn't care less about how I look really, to be honest. Especially clothes-wise. Um... So we might as well just pop this at this point, because now we have three pretty flies. Um, and honestly, the job earns decent here. We can use it to get some bits here and there. Ooh, and there's another pill. Perfect timing. I don't know, what, what pill are we really hoping for here? Because I'm hoping for one that has like a low charge, but high effect. But I don't really know what it would be. Oh, goddamn, jawbone. Honestly, the, the combination of jawbone and finger is pretty good here. You see how much damage that thing does? That's the reason this is just flies. I'm still pretty impressed. That is 
quite nice. I've actually got a, a build that I'm really happy with here, I'll be honest. It's nothing special, but... But yeah, so I'm having to, like, extra prep videos because I'm going to be not able to record videos for approximately four days. Um, I'm, I'm, like, off the... I'm off there for the Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then potentially the Monday as well. So, yeah, I've got to prep a lot of videos uh, to get ready for that. So, essentially, it means basically from today until then, what on earth? This guy is mega. <laughs> from today until then, I kind of have to try. He's he's technically a boss. <laughs> um, oh, Lord. That's uh, two Eternal Hearts. Was there a reason you gave me two Eternal Hearts there? I do not know, but I want to complete it before I end up losing one of them by accident. This is... <laughs> oh my god, look at this lad. Look at this lad. This is funny. Um, But yeah, so I've got to kind of record like two Isaac videos a day, pretty much from then until now, just to make sure I'm ready for it, because uh, I don't want to exhaust my backlog, which means I'm going to be playing a lot of Isaac. going to be playing a lot of Isaac, so... Got a lot of fun topics that I've got to go over. A lot of fun things. To be fair, one thing that I do kind of want to talk about a little bit is just other games on the channel. Because there is a lot of different games that I could play that I haven't got. Damn, this guy's taking so long to kill. Um, I think one of them that I've been kind of looking at. Let's try this out. Range down. Great. Let's get rid of that. Um, one of the ones that I have been looking at is that 20 minutes till dawn and the Brotato, which are both kind of in the same vein. Um, there's kind of been this trend recently of the, I think it's called Vampire Survivors or something along those lines. I never actually played it, but it's it's become a reasonably big type of rogue. Where the hell am I going right now? It's become a reasonably big type of roguelike, to be honest. Um, okay, here we go. I, I feel like a lot of people are playing them on YouTube and they just seem to be doing really well. And they seem like a lot of fun, so... I am considering trying those out, but I, th the problem is I don't really know where they'd fit into the channel. Because right now I'm playing Peglin as kind of my extra game, and people seem to be loving Peglin. I've actually just recorded the first modded episode of Peglin, so that should be coming out pretty soon for you guys. Um, and then obviously I'm keeping up with Nuclear Throne, because that's still a series I really enjoy and does really well. I'm always going to keep up with Enter the Gungeon, just because, again, it's, a, it's one that I quite like. And yeah, just I don't really... So we're going Mother here, aren't we? Um... Yeah, I don't really know where to where to sort of slot it in. It's kind of hard because it's like, I don't want to add it as an additional video because then it my, my amount of videos per week just creeps up and up and up. And I have had it before where I was doing two every single day and it is a bit too much. Like, I don't, I don't want to stretch myself too thin because the thing is when I do that, like... It is good because more content for you guys, and it's, it, it does lead to a wider variety of content, which I always enjoy. But it usually means that one of the games I get incredibly burnt out on because I'm just playing them so much. Um, you, normally, Isaac, surprisingly, isn't one of them. So I, Isaac, at least for me so far, has become fairly immune. I will try this. Isaac, for me so far, has become fairly immune to um, me getting, like, to it getting stale. I think one thing is just because I play it modded, that definitely helps. Um, but other aspects of that are just that it's all, it's more about the commentary and just having my own fun. Like, I feel like if I was playing this every day like I am right now, but on my own, like for myself, yeah, I'd probably be hella bored of it by now. But, um... Playing it the way I do, where it's just kind of like making my own fun, taking weird uh, synergies and trying new things, and just having like kind of a this this sort of freestyle chit chat as we go through. I think it, I think it definitely leads to it being a lot easier going for me. I find it funny that my uh, job just keeps picking up random shit here. Um, I think it, I think it works better for me to be honest, and it keeps it reasonably fresh. I know some people um, are kind of tired of Isaac. I mean, Alexa BD1P have, have both said that. They're teetering on the end of their Isaac careers. I mean, BD1P has already done a very good job at branching out into other content um, and doing, like, challenge videos on games like um, the Star Wars Saga that have been doing very, very well. So there's that sort of stuff. I kind of, I, I kind of need to make sure I don't kill him before he hits that, right? Otherwise, the room won't complete correctly. Okay. Uh, the tower? Um, okay, let's let's go and do the big room. We can use the tower in there. Depending on how many rocks that are already in the room, that is, I suppose. But Seraphim's kind of a good pickup here. I like Seraphim a lot. 
But yeah, I've got like a susceptibly high amount of damage here. Like, it doesn't seem like my damage would be that high, but it really is doing a good job right now. Take you out. I'd say the, the only really annoying thing... Okay, we've got a few Tinted Drops here. That's just too so far. The only really annoying thing about Isaac that I'm kind of fed up of and I really wish it could be sorted is just the lag. Just, like, I want my runs to... I want my runs to run at 60 FPS. And, unfortunately, I doubt that's ever going to be a thing that I can rely on. <laughs> when a deal room doesn't appear after feeding a floor's boss, the boss item is turned into an angel deal for sale or a devil deal. Okay, that's good, but we don't have the money to enable it right now. If I get 15 cent, then I will pick that up. Um, But yeah, so I gotta say, it's, it's just, it's, it's, it's difficult to kind of find a way to keep things entertaining, but also I want to interject as much variety as I can. Like, I kind of want to play, like, Rogue Legacy 2 and stuff, so, like, that's another game that's kind of on my list, but I just don't know how how much interest there is for them, but also how much I can actually get out of a series on a game like that, in terms of how many episodes I'd want to do, and it's difficult. Like, I did Dead Cells, I enjoyed Dead Cells for a little while, but the viewership wasn't quite there. Same with Risk of Rain 2, I played some modded Risk of Rain 2 for a little while, but the viewership wasn't really there either, and it's just kind of difficult to kind of find games that are people like a lot and like we work consistently on the channel hey look penny and burn penny here as well we'll take this because it's not an active eh, it's just decent enough the more enemies in a room the more damage up we get it's only a small damage up to be fair you don't get much but on some of the larger rooms where there's a lot of enemies it does tend to be pretty useful that was close you almost fired me right into that fire there that is not what i was trying to do we're actually getting close to 15 cent here Honestly, I love the finger plus jawbone. I, even the Seraphim on top of it is just pairing together very nicely. I should check the shop. I should check the shop. Confessional at the uh, upon clearing a boss. It's not amazing, but I've never taken it before, so why not? I'm just thinking if I get any ways to get broken hearts, or even if you just have an excess amount of red health, playing them for soul hearts isn't a terrible idea. Or just even just blowing them up. Getting a lot of cell hearts today as well. I don't mind them. I love my cell babies. I love my celly fellas. Damn. I kind of pushed against the wall there. Oh, we got another pill. Another pill. I feel stompy. Okay, on a three room charge, an I feel stompy is not bad. On a three room charge, Leo isn't exactly the greatest in the world. But that's, that's not bad. Hey, he wasn't too bad at all. Could we kill him as the ghost? We get... That's really nice. Because we get a confessional there. Ah, oh, we got the dookie angel deal. We're not going to do Mega Satan here. We're going mother. Oh, we do need another bomb. I just noticed. Does I feel stompy? Let us get in there. Anyways, let's... uh. Go ahead. We'll grab. We'll grab the burn heart thing uh, on the burn penny on the way down. We'll keep this for now. See, we might be able to buy a bomb already. Keep going. The mirror room's just over this way. I thought the mirror room was meant to have an icon. Maybe it doesn't anymore. I don't know. But yeah, I'm, I'm kind of tempted to go and do the boss again. I feel like we have the power to do the boss, especially. With their uh, cat and nine tails on top of what we already have. Well, like this room here is running at like 40 FPS, and it's just like, why can't you just run at 60? <laughs> I get that it's just limitations of modding, but it is sad. <laughs> It'd be so much better if it just worked the way it should. It's just because Lua's bad, and the modding API is bad. It's not even the fact that, like, People that make mods make them terribly, or the game's off awfully laggy on its own. Got another new pill here. Try it out. Shot speed up. Shot speed up doesn't do much for us, to be honest. I think the I feel stompy pill could be better. I'm also intrigued to see what's going to be in here. Okay, nothing. A 
Hey, more bombs, that's good. Oh, I've got petrified poops, keep popping those poops. I might as well actually take the other one as well, right? Good, good. Okay. More bombs, wow. I only needed one, the game's like, here's ten. Hey, this is a ton of money as well. I can't remember what a shop had in it now. Oh, uh, it was the confessional thing, wasn't it? So we got that. I think we can take on the boss, I'll be honest. It's a bit of a risk, I realise. But I think we have the power. I think we have the know-how. I think we have the gusto. Let's take it on. Also, by the way, something that I'd just like to ask and sort of understand more and, and just kind of vet out is how many people watch these videos? How many people, like, active, actively watch? So, because I know there's a few different type of viewers. So, there's, there's some of you that might watch the video and, 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 and like, I mean watch it, like, watch it the whole way through to the end. Uh, some people watch it in parts where they'll watch, like, a video just as far as they can get through it, as far as they have time for. They might come back to for it or they might just come back to the next episode it depends there's other people that will purely listen there's other people that just put it on while they go to sleep which one are you i'd be interested to find out i'd be very intrigued to see because personally i'm the sort i i kind of when i watch youtube i normally put it on as i go to bed watch a video or two however much i can make it through and then just fall asleep with youtube on <coughs> So stuff like Northern Lion, countless times I've seen an episode, but I've not actually seen what happened in it. I just fell asleep. I, I saw like the first three minutes and then fell straight asleep. <laughs> and then woke up like six episodes later sort of thing. It'd be interesting to know how many people kind of do that with my content. I, I, I wouldn't be offended by any which way people watch my content. Not at all. That's technically a trinket. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll give this a go. We'll give this a go. Right, we just need to bomb down now. We got a key piece. We'll take our... Oh, wait, no. We can't take that now. Let's just take this. And this could potentially be better anyways. And we bomb on through. Good, good. I will be skipping uh, the knife piece to search, by the way. Just by giving myself the knife piece. Just because a mod doesn't exist to give, skip only the second bit. So I'm going to do... Give a knife piece two. There you go. Oh, I really shouldn't have done it now because I, I sh I'm not supposed to have the knife yet. I should have done it later. I have cheated you all. I'm sorry. I mean, to be fair, I could just do that, and then yeah, then just give 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 ourselves it when I actually need it. <coughs> I really apologize about the coughing. I really hope it stops soon. Ooh, you're lighting them all on fire, are you? Mega chest. Not really found a use for our stompy pill yet. To be honest, it isn't the best, but it's just kind of there right now. It's just kind of there. Magician. Peeper's eye, it does give us um, a bit of extra damage in one eye, but I think, oh, yes. I was going to say, I think the other thing would be better. And it was. Abyss bombs are great. More pills, please. More pills. Oh god, I, th I keep thinking I have flights. I was playing as the Lost for so long, last floor. Stupid. A black candle's awesome. Small rock is also very good. We are getting some banger items right now. I'm in a good mood today. Okay. Um, another new pill. Look down. God damn it, game. Give me some good pills. Okay, that was good. I ended up getting him out of that soul immediately. This, this boss is tough. I have a hard time with this guy.
I don't care where these bombs go. I think the burn was just blocking most of my shots then. Ow! Ah! Ah! I still don't really know this guy's patterns. He's a very cool boss, but yeah, I don't know what's going on. Bit of range up. Not a great stat to get there, but not bad. This isn't great. I think we're good to go on this floor. I, I often don't bother searching all the rooms. That's another reason that I think the good trip mod isn't really for me. Because with the good trip mod, I feel like <clears throat> I'd clear all those extra rooms that I wouldn't normally be clearing because it doesn't it doesn't waste my time. Whereas normally when I play the game, I'm like, ah, I'm not gonna go to those rooms because they're waste, they're a waste of my time sort of thing. Um, and that's that's a good thing. Sometimes there should be that trade-off. Do you want to spend extra time on the floor going back and forth to get to those extra rooms, or do you just want to leave? Whereas a good trip just removes that decision completely. It's of course you want to go to the extra rooms. It doesn't waste any time at all. Yeah, Mum's race is decent, but I feel like the other one could be better. Yeah, I'm, I'm happier with that. I haven't really found any secret rooms this run, have we? I mean, to be fair, I've not been looking. This could be secret room here, shouldn't it? I say, I'm really good at finding secret rooms. So I should find them more often. Another pretty fly there. I found pills. We are really having a bad time of it right now, aren't we? God damn. Thought we'd have gotten something a little bit better by now. We are on a one room charge for our pill currently though. Like, what, I'm trying to think what would even be the use of <laughs> an I found pills one on a one room charge. I guess, I don't know. There might, there might be some use with like tele, with like broken teleporter or something I guess. Steam sale there's kind of nice. Grip grab. Nothing in this room even. Okay, still no use for my stompy pills. I've, I've got them like locked and loaded in case we need them, but we don't really right now. Okay, right now I'm gonna give myself this back because I would do this before going for the boss. Red Reap Creep. Ooh, he's got Hemolacria shots. They're really cool. And Brimstone's probably coming in the second. Yep. More of the Void. Yes, please. Well, th that doesn't even actually... Okay, it doesn't... I thought it had cost the Trinket. Um, And then we're onto the mines. Onto the mines, onto the mausoleum. Let's go. Health! A little shaky. I'm kind of hoping we get, like, Balls of Steel soon, or perks would be really nice. Just to be able to have a perks pill for the boss fight. Not a fan of this. That almost went real bad. Okay, this is a decent room for Isle Feel Stompy. A extra pill there, nice. Black heart there, beautiful. Good stuff. Destroying all the skulls, see what we can get. Okay, see what this other pill is in a moment. That's a lot of spike chest. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Damn it, didn't quite work. Oh no, I got hit so much there. Basically, my intention there, if you didn't know, was to try and hit every single one of those chests um, in one in one like hit. Blood clot. That's pretty good. I tried to hit every single one of them in one go, but didn't quite work out my way. Um, I'm perplexed about how this room works. Oh my lord. 
Oh my god, that room is awful. <laughs> that room hurts. Cancer. Now that is a good item for us to get right now. Not only do we kind of desperately need the HP, but I was just talking about getting a perks pill, and now we effectively have it. Okay, try this pill. LSD. We could get permanent LSD effects. That's not going to hurt our eyes at all. Oh lord. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I want permanent LSD effect in my eyes. I will grab Humble and Bundle. I want another pill in the shop, come on. I will definitely take that. And there's the pill. It's a tears down! You son of a bitch! This is not what I requested, game. Oh my god, LSD is crazy. When does it end? Is it, is it like so many rooms done? I don't really know what the prerequisite is for this being over. <laughs> I could just whack LSD on for the entire run. Oh god, this guy's eternal. I've not fought this guy eternal before. He is rough. Intriguing. Intriguing. Oh, the heart's the one left alive. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. And there's Mum's knife. Um, I think yes. Health is looking not great. LSD's over now though, so I can actually fucking see. Um, yeah, health isn't looking great. We're gonna have to work on that. But we did just get Mum's knife. Which plays nicely into winning the run. Although I'm very confused about which knife is which right now. The, the finger plus the plus the thingy knife plus my mum's knife. Oh god, it's all sorts of confusing right now. I don't know what's going on. I've lost a lot of health just there. The positioning of the finger plus the knife is the most confusing. What the hell just happened? Oh, I think I've got Kester Bears. Wait, no. Okay, I'm just looking at the map wrong. Oh, another I found pills. Okay, I think I'm being kind of screwed over by the fact that I have incredibly low range for Mum's knife. I also think I need to be using more of the void more more often. I'm not really utilizing it as much as I could be. It's a good tool for us. Hey. And of course it's the only, the one and only, this guy, who is gonna deal a good amount of damage to me. Yeah, my health has gone to shit. I really hope we get a good shot here. Damn it, that hit me. I might die. Things are not going well. Oh god, hello. Oh god, I am definitely going to die. Oh lord. I forget how hard the mausoleum is sometimes. Dude, my pretty flies are saving my ass right now. Damn it. This had to be a banger shop and it is most definitely not.
Diggity damn. Our item rooms have not been great either. That is, when picking up a coin, there's a small chance to spawn a buyable shop item. Why not? We got Explorer's Instinct, I guess. That's nice. We can go in here. Does give us HP. Okay, now that's that's better. I said this is better. My my fucking thing keeps picking it up. But stop, Jawburn! Stop it, Jawburn! Fuck off! I don't want the trinket. <laughs> This is a really hard phase to hit this guy during. Stop grabbing the trinkets, you ape. Golden bombs is nice. Okay. This is good. We do have a rotten heart, though, which does not bode well. Um... Holy water isn't upgradable, man. Why does this mod have so many familiars that aren't upgradable? I get it's a hard mod to make, but like, so many of them don't work. It's crazy. Bad trip. Great. That was good. Freezing effect is nice. And this actually could be decent. Not only is this a room where we can... Damn it. Doesn't matter. I was going to say get some cards, but also a room where we could maybe get ourselves a health upgrade and then it blew him up. So I guess not. This is, um, is going to be a real rough fight right here. I'm liking our uh, Seraphim Holy Light, baby. That's uh, insanely strong. God damn pretty flies are saving my life right now. Got him. Good, good. Take this. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Evil game. Evil. We've slightly redeemed ourselves, but not, not by all that much. Okay, the slowing shots also don't actually help us all that much. Try my best to get more of the void in there when I can. Not easy. I don't know how to dodge this. Yep. I can't fucking see what I'm doing. Okay. Come on, you. Hey! <laughs> it worked out eventually. I mean, we should be blowing them up as well, actually. Okay. Let's go. Could you be my hero, baby? Not really. Thanks for the cash. The frail. Where is he? Okay, he's dead. Good. What the hell hit me then? Cheeky bastard of a game. I don't even know what hit me. He obviously fired a tear, but I did not see it. Uh... 
Wheel of Fortune. Damn it, that's not the right Wheel of Fortune. Also, bit sad that Placebo basically never gave us an avenue to success. It never gave us a decent pill. All I'm thinking to myself is, okay, well, I've been hit again. All I'm thinking to myself is, if I can get enough HP by the time we get to the boss, we do have cancer. So we have twice whatever we have. But it's looking more and more unlikely every single room. That hit me. Why? And how? Damn it. That's a lot of poison. Double lucky pennies there. Come on, drop a heart for me, game, please. Something to save me from this nothing I've become. Is he eternal? I don't know where to stand. Fuck me. Ah, ah. What the hell? <laughs> How did I survive that? I don't think that does anything for us. We've got crazy shot speed, but not any use. Right. We did make it to the last floor. I don't really know how, I'll be honest. That is a cell heart there. I think we need to make sure we enter every room with more of the void. Good to go. It's nice having um, holy water too. Something I've been underrating a bit. Gimme, gimme, gimme some soul hearts. Please, game. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Dude! You jumping jackrabbit little shithead. Oh no. Yeah, this this is the room. This is the room. Holy fuck. I thought that was it. Well, that that whole that whole speech about just hold out and get health and we'll be fine. Didn't really work out so well, did it? Ah, oh, I lost my burn heart too. Oh, just to rub salt in the wound, the first heart we've seen in ages. Just after we would have needed it. Thanks, game. Glad you were listening. Literally no time for cancer to even take effect at this point. So that's good. Probably going to have to no-hit this fella. Ooh, but look, guys. Our... Our pill turned into a full health pill. That's good, right? Damn you, game. You insolent little shit. These eyes need to fuck off. Oh my god, them eyes are stressing me out. This, this, this is it. Th these enemies. Ah! And we all fall down. There is absolutely no way in hell I do this without getting hit.
Okay, that's one phase. But that, the first phase is not where I normally get hit, so... This is one that I get hit to a lot, and we don't have the range to do any damage during this attack, and it lowers the frame rate to about one. This is bad. I'm so close to him right now. Holy shit. Holy shit. No! No! You! You little fucker! I, I fucking... Oh, I saw it. I knew that that could have happened. But I thought I was in the clear as soon as I saw the bottom left tears disappear. I thought I was in the clear. That was... Devastating. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god. That was... Oh. That was... That was something. Boy, oh, yo, 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 That was something. Holy... That was fun, though. <laughs> that was so close to a win as well. I almost falls, mother. God damn. Yeah, like, it's because it passed through her decaying body, and I just couldn't see it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed nonetheless, and I'll see you guys in the next one.